but the free it's been a while as usual. Actually, how long has it been? What's that? I don't know. Why are you asking me? I'm here with you. Well, I was, but you just kind of just ran off. What the hell's going on here? A moment. Huh. It's only been just one day short of a week since I last recorded then. Stroke, stroke, stroke! This old guy clearly has hobbies and interests different from regular people. In bondage. Stroke, stroke, stroke! He smells like the forest. I think he should go back there where he belongs. This strange girlish boyish girlish person has been rolling around here all tied up. But I don't know what to do, so I'm just standing here doing nothing. Uh, what's it called? Uh, uh, there's a name for this type of situation. Uh, what was it? Uh, Oh yeah, bystander effect. That's taking place just like, well, somebody's got to act, actually do something. We're not going to. She's asking for help, but the only thing I can think of is to, sta is to stand her up. What should I do? Should I stand her up? That's the thing, man. He's just like, oh, what? Someone should probably do something about this, but nobody wants to. <laughs> can I say something completely off topic? Sure. I picked up this doorknob the other day. When I was here, say that the time so I threw it to the east, so as far as I could. I wound it, it wound up, uh, dislocating my shoulder as a result. Actually, I was just fibbing about, about that last part. Ha 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 ha! Oh, doorknobs. Well, the one doorknob. If we cut her rope, she'll be free, right? But what if she goes crazy and hurts people if we do? <laughs> what are you doing? Sniff my hand. I'm doing the gaggle on my own. I just move my mouth up and down like so and slowly slip it off. Oh, I'm wonderful. Ah, uh, let's leave right now. This, this is like. I don't even know what the hell <laughs> this is like a fish. A bondage loving fish trans something. I don't even know what the hell it is. I mean I mean it just essentially looks like it's just a bunch of guys like maybe middle aged in drag, but they're not. So what the hell are they? Like of the description of their voices, it makes it sound like they're multi python characters. I hate to be a bother, but could you stand up me up? Now could you push me over the bridge? Thank you, darling. I don't know what happened. I was minding my own business, taking off my makeup, when suddenly I was physically assaulted. Oh, what a fabulous time to be attacked. What is? What is a time to be attacked? Just like, oh, that was a perfect time to be attacked then. Oh my! You're that boy I met at the hot spring the other day, aren't you? It seems the friends of fate have led us to each other again. The moment I realized you could use BSI, I knew there was something between us. You're undoubtedly the one we mad gypsies have been waiting for. You're talking to Boney or Lucas. For tens of thousands of years, right? I don't know, he's not 10,000 years old, is he? Can you sense it too? Can't you feel the time drawing near? It's okay, Picard, I'm not entirely sure about it either. Wait a second, if I was attacked, could it mean? I hope I only is all right. I wish I could fly there, but I can't without my makeup on. Uh, uh, you know, is that blue supposed to be a beard or is that makeup? Because it's got no makeup on, so I'm assuming it's a beard. All I can do is walk on land like a human. How tragic. I could swim like a fish with my movement, but that would be troublesome. Oh well, I'll walk if I have to. And you, you're coming with me. Come on, let's go to Iolia's house. Okay? No. This isn't like packing for a trip or brushing your teeth or any daily chores like that. This is on a whole different level altogether. 
We're going to Iolia's house together, okay? No. Too bad we're going! It's like I will pester you for as long as it takes, Ionia, to join your body. We could reach Ionia's house easily by going straight up this river, but... Hold on, you guys. I have no idea what you were talking about just now, but if it's up the river you need to go, then it's our time to shine. Come on, follow us. I don't know, man. <laughs> what the hell? Yo, doggy, what do you got to say? <laughs> now that the lightning has stopped, I feel much tougher. Should we... Should we take the boat? Where is... No, the boat wouldn't be over here, would it? Where am I? So where the hell are they? Because the other option is to go through the forest, and the forest has items, so we're going to the forest. A new friend? What a strange person. Oh, hi there, Lucas. You know, you should really be mindful of who you make friends with. Have you finally started to go crazy, too? It seems the factory's been closed down, so I expect my little Biffy and Butchie to come back home. But they wound up going to some new pork something or other instead. I think I met one of your relatives the other day. I can't remember which party it was, though. You know, I wonder what happened to Reggie. Is he still around? I mean, where did he go? Hey, 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 hey. Doggy. Okay. I don't want to go to the city, I like it here. Even if the door's open, I don't give a shit. Where am I even going? Hmm. That man over there, he still keeps looking this way, what the hell? Blah 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 blah. Wait. There's so many extra there, but who cares? We're going in the complete opposite direction of where we're supposed to go. If you wonder why I'm just like moving so slowly and not really paying attention to where I'm going, it's because I was drinking some Dr. Pepper. Whoa, watch it there. Do -do -do -do. Let's go find the boots. Gotta be around here somewhere. Wait, I think I remember it's over here, isn't it? We just got this, it's the greatest boat ever! You'll get on it, of course! Row, row, row your boat gently down the stream. How's that work? Is it automatic? It's the castle. There's a present right there. Do we stop? Wait, I think we are. Thank you. Does it mean we won't be able to get across with the frogs? Ribbit, 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 rabbit. Something. You can have the present. We don't want it anyway. All information. Ah, that's gonna be a lot of weight for one frog. Mm. 
you heard a waltz room. Ah. <laughs> it's just random. So these would give us the correct direction to go if we went the L way. I believe that I will show you which direction you need to go. Round and round we go where I stop soon you know. So let's go in a different direction instead. No, never mind. Wow, ah, screw it. Just move on ahead. Oh, that was fast. Bony did the milking. Don't do that, man. Don't do that, man. You're you're scaring him. Oh, what happens? Why aren't you wearing any makeup, Ionia? This is no time to be silly, Ionia. I was attacked, so I rushed here to see if you were all right. I'm just fine. I'm as lively as I always am. But never mind me. Why don't you untie that rope already? Oh, I wish uh, I was in such a rush I never even noticed. How could you not notice? What a shock! Who guess could you untie me now? Unbelievable, you have no sense of courtesy. You <laughs> should look as if, like, I thought you were into that, though. Oh, who's that fine figure? Why, that's me without makeup! I'm such even without makeup on! Man, just what the hell? Just one second! There, all done, I'm pretty again! Yuck! You can keep that lipstick! Indirect kisses with other girls I under my thing! Oh, I have a bad feeling. What could it be? What could it be? What could it be? That, perhaps? Well, isn't that a bit of a pisser? What's going on? Well, wasn't that just fantastic? Uh-oh. Oh my, I only uh, your body, your body, it's starting to disappear. Oh my, oh my, oh my. So it is, it's disappearing. I'm disappearing, but I'm... Uh... Wait, what? What does this mean? Did I only say... That she was also disappearing? Well, she, he, it. Because that doesn't seem to be the case. The needle in Osho Castle that I've protected for so long. Someone has pulled it. Someone able to pull the needles has finally appeared. The dark dragon, the seal away by the seven needles, will awaken. And. And the table will rise and reveal a ladder that we would have probably noticed if we just looked under the table. You can get to the courtyard of Oshu Castle through this underground path. It's Aeolia speaking, right? So why is it saying Aeolia instead? If the needle really has been pulled, I will vanish very soon. But it'd be wise to know who pulled it. Someone with a dark heart or someone with a light heart. I think I said the previous sentence incorrectly. Yet that may change the fate of the world completely. Ooh! So 
today is the day of disappear. Hi, Odio, what's your name and doggy? Bye bye. Hi, Odio. You were an open hearted person. That's why we got along so well. Won't you leave a razor and some lipstick or what? Okay, let's follow this underground path to Oshu Castle's courtyard. What the hell is this? Is that a hand? Receive the hell is memento. No, seriously, what the hell? No, 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 it wouldn't be there, you idiot. It'd be... Let's have a look, see. Probably key items. Or... Uh, uh, not? Yeah, it was a razor and lipstick. Well, I have an idea for something I will do for these, then. Let's in memory play Iolia mode in the key of B minor. Why not? Wait, no, it'd be hard to pick up with this music, though. Well, there's no other way to go about it, really, is it? So... Wait, no, that's C-sharp. I said B. Just realized I still have my freaking guitar pick well, resting in, in between the strings of the guitar, but whatever. It probably sounded really off. The old guy's there again. Yes! Well, isn't this an odd sight? Some random kid, a transvestite, uh. Well, it's not really a transvestite. I don't even know what the hell it is, but you got that, a dog, and an old man. This game has some really bizarre scenarios. Even down to everyday things. Like going to a hot spring and there's like some random old guy there. And you decide to like bathe in hot spring, but you've also got your dog with you and some random transvestite. That's into bondage for some reason. Cleocatra! Yeah! Ow! Bastard! You could support me more than that, you're a mad gypsy! You have PSI, it should surely be stronger. I mean, the cat's doing better than us. The cat's got better PSI! Batting her false eyelashes! Just be like, oh, I can't possibly involve dearies, she'll spoil my makeup! You can keep that secret herb, it's not fashionable at all! Beep jerky! Hello, Cleocatra! What's in prison number two? Some rotten milk. You know, Oshu Castle must actually be a pretty damn big place. Oh, shit. You know, in that battle, they kept saying Ionia let out a little scream or something like that, so it was just like, Aah! Just like, what the hell are you doing, man? What's that gotta do? Uh, this place is just like a damn maze, isn't it? Have we even got a map? Eh, uh, doesn't seem to. Some magic torch. Ooh, ha ha ha! No life up there. 
did life up beta, but what didn't do shit with that kind of attack, did it? Level up. What? That was brief. You only like, yeah, level up. Uh, uh, you only get like one little increase, and that's it. really has been pulled. Somebody farted where it was. I have absolutely no idea who pulled it. The Dark Dragon's hut will become as light or as dark as the person who pulls it. That's what it said anyway, but I don't sense anything here at all. I don't sense a heart or good of, of good or evil. How mysterious. Could that be? Could there be people in this world without hearts? I always assumed that the Dark Dragon would stay sealed away for eternity. No! We still have a chance left! You were able to learn PK Guitar! Could it be that you're also able to... Play music? Oh, that's right! I haven't explained anything to you at all. I need to tell you about the needles. In this incredibly high-pitched voice. First, know this, I'm not going to read this in a high-pitched voice, so, yeah. These are specially protected islands. We reside upon these islands together with a limitless power. That power is the dragon that sleeps in the darkness under the islands. The dragon is incredibly large, about as large as all these islands put together. Because the dragon is asleep, these islands are protected from disaster, but its power is too great for humans to control. It was for this reason that our ancient mad gypsy ancestors placed seven needles in the dragon to make it sleep. One needle for each mad gypsy. For a very, very long time, we have continued to guard the needles. But it has been told that someone to make the dragon will appear when its power is needed. What kind of power? Just like, it will wake up and it will destroy everything. However, if the one who needs the dragon's power has a heart of evil, that power will obey all that is evil. It's very possible that everything could be completely destroyed simply to satisfy wicked ambition. On the other hand, the exact opposite is what we hope for. A person with their heart of good pulls the dragon's needles and uses power. The fate of all evil will be washed away, and all life as we know it will shine brightly. Except for the evil one, it still be screwed. That is what is told. Finally, listen to this. But don't worry. When each of our seven needles is pulled, we and Magipsies will cease to be our millennia long lives over. Isn't that just romantic for us? Of us. No, it's gotta be spoken in. It's not just romantic of us! So yeah, in short, put all the needles have a heart of gold or a heart of, uh, wait, you know, gold is like, a, it's just, that's, it's weird when you really see it like that, it's like, heart of gold, it's like, so, by that, they mean like, really good hearty person, but when you say it like that, it could also mean just like, heart of gold, you know, as in they don't have any actual feelings at all, very materialistic. There's one other legend. It says only those with the power of PK Guitar can pull the seven needles. Not even we magipsies have that ability. In other words, you'll be able to pull the needles because you're a chosen boy. Some sort of incredible power seems to be sleeping here. Please hurry here. We've located the next needle. But, 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 the monkey. We need the monkey. The monkey can open it. Yeah, what a pain in the neck. Anyway, the monkey is the key. I'll explain the details later. But please come to the Chimera Lab. I assume you know where the Chimera Lab is, right? Yeah, no. Huh? Commander, your voice sounds kind of cheery today. Well, anyways. Please take the crossroad train to the factory. And when you arrive, go west from the ropeway station that's behind the factory. Did you get all that? Nope. But I'll say I will anyway. Oh, if you knew where it is, then there's no problem at all. Please hurry. Beep. 
Got a transceiver. That ladder is a shortcut back to Tasmili. Head there. I'm worried about my own needle now. I just know we'll meet again. But if we don't, then that means one of us has left this world. <laughs> bye bye! Oh god, that pose! <laughs> what the fuck's going on? What the fuck was that? Yeah, do you need something? No comment on that, Mr. Frog. Just like, what the hell was that? Please be careful out there. Some weird shit going on around here. And lag's one of them, apparently. Can we not examine? So, this needle, I think, is the needle that we could see in Chapter 2, I think it was, when we came here as, as Duster with Wes. I commented on it and said, that's not the important item, though, that we're here for. But now, it's certainly going to play an important role, these needles. Very plot-related. You unlocked the door! Ah, it leads back out here. Where? Wasn't there another door somewhere around here that... I can't really remember. Oh my god, what have we got here? A bro team and the cohort. Wow. They all look pretty random. Let's rock their socks off. Rock and roll! Well, Cheery Skeleton couldn't handle the power of rock and roll. Oh! Oh, good God! Knock him out, knock him out, knock him out, knock him out! Oh, shit! Knock him out! Knock him out! Suddenly, they become quite threatening. What? That was confusing there for a second. Hey, Mr. Frog Ping, whatever. Oh, shit. Hold on, let me just get my makeup. I mean, uh, the goods. The goods being a bag of pork chips. And... Some rotten milk. And some nut bread, booty, and, uh, yeah. Okay, now we'll do battle. Level up. That's how a level up should go. You know, loads of stat increases instead of just, like, a puny amount. You know, when did these guys come back? The well, we didn't actually go to this room when we came back here, did we? I guess we kind of overlooked them. Wait, the ghosts are back. The ghosts are back. Does that mean he's back as well? Nope, still closed up shop. See if the party ghost is still around. You know, while we're in the area. Yep, still around. We party to buy for so long, they're about to get old. So more and more of us left the party laughing, went on and shit. So how many of you guys left? Well, I'm surprised you came here. This castle's so boring now. Could you say it was the same of every year ago? Oh, but there's ain't nothing about it yet. But anyway, let's talk about some shit, right? No, well, well, screw you too. So that's one, two... There are certain strangely shaped rocks that wash up on shores up and over the same size. People long ago used to think they looked like a butt-bellied Buddha. So they called them butt-belly stones. In actuality, they're dolphin-ozzles. An ozzle is an earbone, just in case you didn't know. 
They're extremely hard. Apparently, they wash up on shore because they don't dissolve in the ocean. I bet you could find some in the Zerulean Beach area if you look. It's just being little ghosty's mini trivia corner. Do you find it interesting? Sure. Here, I'll give you an actual dolphin ask you. Well, that was random. Is the chef still around? I wanna cook, I wanna cook, ah, I wanna cook. It's gonna haunt me forever. Kinda weird for a ghost to say that something will haunt them forever. Run away, ow. Search! Out of the way, bitch. You're too weak. Can we do that to the ghost as well? Yep. Neato. Woof, woof, what? What are you doing? Lucas, have you seen Flint? He was just here visiting her hour's grave. He's probably headed back into the mountains yet again to look for Klaus. Look for Klaus, visit her hour's grave. Look for Klaus, visit her hour's grave. That's all your old man does anymore. His only salvation is you, Lucas. You've grown so strong that Flint doesn't need to worry anymore. You've grown up to be a truly good lad. Here, Flint gave me this. He asked me to give it to you the next time you came by. Supposedly it's a good luck charm your pops treasured here, uh, he, well, since he was a boy himself. Got a courage badge. Oh, may be God, but even now she's watching over you and your family. Give that to us, didn't he? Oh wait, it's right there. The rust and dirt conceals the design underneath. It's incredibly old. So it's a key item. Sparring nonsense. Everyone's waiting at the Camara Lab. I still haven't arrived yet, though. The reason being that I forgot how to get there. I mean, I understand the directions, but... To get to the Camara Lab, you take the crossroad train to the factory. And then head west from the ropeway station. The problem is that I don't know where I am right now. Hello? Are you alright, Commander? Hi. Oh, 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 I see the Camara Lab now. You were right. You take the crossroad train to the factory and then head west from the up rope ropeway station. Click, click. What the hell are you talking about? So we catch the train to the station. Wait, no, this is the station. I mean, we take the train to the factory, then we go to. Yes. Trains are much less exhausted than walking, and they're so inexpensive and inviting. They're so cheap, they're practically free. A mere 50 dB for the right one. In that case, how about taking the green train? The green one costs a little bit more, though. Sure. Oh, really? Then it'll be 200 DP for two tickets. Please get on before you change your mind. 
Not enough money, piss off. Man, why? Why is everything so expensive?